Hey, what's up guys? So in this video, I'm going to show you an amazing feature on your Galaxy devices that you can use to automate almost any task on your phone. So to take a look at this feature, we will first go into the Good Lock app and in here, we will go in Life Up and here scroll up and you will find Routines Plus. Now, if you don't have it downloaded, you'll tap on it and it will download from the Galaxy Store and once it's downloaded, Simply go in it and here you will see the second option called run a touch macro. Now this is almost a magical feature on your Galaxy devices. Now if I tap on it, I can set it up to do almost anything on my phone. So you will see two options here, start manually and we'll leave it as that because we will initiate an action by tapping on the widget. And once we'll do that, what will happen then, we can set it up here. Just tap on it and here add, and it will open a list of apps that you want to accomplish this function. Now for this video, I'm gonna use this feature to change wallpapers on my phone every day. So I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna find my wallpaper app of choice, which is backdrops and go next. And now you will see this um, box open up here which has all of these different buttons but we will tap on record and now it will record everything that we are doing so first of all uh, i'm gonna refresh the app because this will refresh the wall of the day here and then i'm gonna tap on it i'm gonna tap select and here i'm gonna select home and lock screen now you can see that as i'm tapping on the screen it is recording my gestures as well so i'll select home and lock screen and there you go and now if i'll go back i'll have a new wallpaper so i'm going to stop it and then i'm going to save it here you can name this macro i'm going to name it wallpapers and i'm going to save it select it and press done and then it is saved so once we have created a touch macro now we need to go in settings go in modes and routines and here go in routines and here we will create a new routine so here we will select manually and here we will go in good lock and touch macro and we'll select the wallpaper macro that we created and then we'll press done and then we'll save it and then it will ask us to name this routine so we can just name it then you can also obviously you can add icons to it so let's make it a little bit better i'm gonna do it like this press done now that we have created our routine the next step is to add a widget button on the home screen so we will long press here go in widgets and look for modes and routines widget so there you go and here we will add single routine button and now because I only have one routine created it has detected it and it has added it as uh, the widget. Now see what happens when I'll tap on this button the whole process that I've shown you of changing the wallpaper will carry out itself because everything has been recorded in the touch macro. And there you go the backdrops app is open and it will now refresh it and you can see that it is retracing all the steps that i did while creating the touch macro so now it has selected the wall of the day it will set it up as home and lock screen and you can see it running here as well you can also pause it and you can cancel it if you want it's up to you and while creating your touch macro you can be really fast and efficient to do this stuff within seconds because i was explaining there was gaps uh, in the process and that is why it is taking uh, a bit longer and there you go the routine has run and with just one tap of a button the wallpaper has changed it's such a fantastic feature you can automate almost anything on your phone using this feature and uh, relieve yourself of that burden so that's about it from this video guys i hope you have learned something new here let me know how you are using this feature in the comments below i will see you in the next one till then take care Bye bye